The Nigerian Deficit Insurance Corporation, NDIC, Thursday hinted that directors of the recently closed 183 microfinance banks, MFBs and primary mortgage banks, PMBs, will soon be investigated for their roles in the collapse of the institutions. Managing Director, Chief Executive, NDIC, Bello Hassan, disclosed this in Lagos at a workshop organized by the Corporation for Law Enforcement Agencies. Hassan said that the workshop is a demonstration of NDIC's commitment to collaborating with other agencies against financial malpractices and insider abuses in banks. It's a traditional workshop for uh, law enforcement agencies. Uh, it's an annual event uh, which is meant to collaborate with uh, uh, you know, relevant uh, agencies that are involved in the fight uh, against uh, you know, uh, curtailing financial malpractices and fraud in uh, financial institutions, particularly in banks and, uh, you know, uh, other financial institutions. And the essence is to ensure that uh, we sustain it and uh, bring uh, to book uh, errant directors, officers, managers, uh, of these banks that uh, led to the collapse. They have forced the opportunity of getting the officers, you know, further enlightened, further sensitized about the goings on in the financial services industry. You know, we are all aware that in the industry, just like any other industry, you have malpractices happening around there in the food industry, in the bank industry, but being a very regulated industry, it is necessary that the nitty-gritty, the technical nature of the operations in the banking industry needs to be understood for law enforcement agencies to be able to do their investigative um, work. You know, with the advent of technology, the internet and the phone, people have, uh, I mean, migrated from the local crimes that we used to see to international crimes. There are no borders anymore. People can stay in one country, commit crime. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.